Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Ladies First. I'm Grace and you guys may have seen me in the class series or in some of the Teen Titan videos. So it's my first time filming on Ladies First and I'm so excited. So it's back to school season right now and some of you guys may already be in school and some of you guys may be going back to school soon. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys 5 different outfits that you can wear and look really fashionable in. University right now and I don't really have a dress code that I have to follow so really good for me but you know if you guys have a dress code that you have to follow I'll be sharing with you guys some little tips and adjustments that you can make to the outfit so that you know you can still follow your dress code and look really good in school let's go <music> So for the first outfit, I chose this blue dress. It's super pretty and very dainty looking. And it has this really cute fabric that has polka dots on it. And it just really adds a very nice texture and a sensual feeling because it's also pretty flowy. And what's really amazing about this dress is that it has pockets on the side. So it really adds this level of like practicalness in it because you know, you're going to school after all. And with these pockets, you can always just throw in some pants or you know, student cards so it makes your life a lot easier. So my favorite thing about this dress is actually the puff sleeves. I'm a sucker for puff sleeves. I always find puff sleeves tops and puff sleeves dresses. It just adds that very feminine aesthetic and it just really completes the whole look in itself. So I decided to style this outfit with some butterfly clips. So the butterfly clips I chose are also in blue in colour to match the dress. So you know, because it's going to school, you guys can go for a shorter heel. It's something like the one I chose today. And if you don't feel like you're a heel person, you can also style it with sneakers. I think it will go really nice with white sneakers. Yeah. So for the second outfit, I chose something more casual but it's more presentable. For example, you have a presentation that you have to do that day. You can wear this outfit. It's basically a blazer cohort set. So it is a green colour outfit because you know it can look a little bit special even though you want to like do a presentation. So it really helps you stand out. Like for example, you know when you have a presentation, you'll have to wear something more formal and you know one would like usually think, oh I have to wear like the restrictive work pants and a white top. But you know I want to show you guys that you can wear something that's really fashionable. So to add a little like oomph to this outfit, I've decided to style it with a half updo and it kind of looks a little bit like Ariana Grande, you know, if I could say myself. So I also used a scrunchie because, you know, scrunchie, they're super in and I love them. For the accessories, I didn't give it too much, like statement pieces and all that. Instead, I chose a very small dainty necklace. So the next outfit is for those girls who are more sporty or you know if you're just running late actually and you just want to like grab a few clothing and you know make it look like it works. For this outfit, I basically chose a tank top and a sweatpants. So you know loungewear is super comfy, that's why I love them. If you want to like make this outfit look more preppy, you can also throw on a cardigan. So for me, I like to like just dangle the cardigan on my shoulder because it makes me look more cool. And another way is to just wrap it around you and just make a little bow or just a knot will do. And that will make it look in a sense edgy but preppy at the same time. I paired this outfit with some chunky sneakers and I really love chunky sneakers because it gives that really sporty look. And you know for this outfit, I'm pretty sure I've seen like Kendall Jenner, Hailey Bieber, all of them wearing something similar to this. So all you gotta do is just bind up your hair in a messy bun and then throw on some hoops or some gold accessories and then you immediately look like your off-duty model. I know you're enjoying this video, but did you know that we actually have a podcast? Yeah, it's called Girl Code and it's only on Spotify. So see you there. Bye! The next look, I chose something a little bit more different. We are going for more of an athleisure look. And you know, when you think athleisure, you immediately think like yoga pants and you know, a sports top. But I want to show you guys that you can actually make it look more feminine just by wearing something like this. For this quad, it's basically a polo top and also a little skirt that matches. So the top has like this polo shirt kind of detail but it's a crop top 
and I really like it because you know it gives that very expensive like um, country club kind of look so even though you're going to school you can pretend you're in a country club just by wearing this little co-op and the color is really really nice I like the blue it kind of reminds me of the sky I actually paired this look with some chunky sneakers also which also adds another element of sportiness to add a little like spice in this look, I also thrown on a really cute little white bag but I think that it's quite easy to match any bag with this outfit. So for this next outfit, we're actually giving you guys a sneak peek of a potential new Titan Academy uniform. Do let us know what you think about the new uniforms in the comments down below. For this uniform, we have a blazer and we have our matching, you know, checkered skirt. And that is super like clueless. Do you guys watch the show Clueless? So the main character, Cher, has this super iconic yellow plate set that she wears and I'm just obsessed with that. So I guess this uniform that we have kind of alludes a little bit to that. So for the blazer, that we have. It has this really cool uh, white lining which gives that very preppy school look and also makes it look very more defined and structured. And also we have this really nice gold embroidered crest which really highlights and is the focal point of the Titan Academy logo. So you know if you have a really standard uniform, something similar to this, you can actually accessorize with a headband. And that's also kind of like, you know, Blair Waldorf from Gossip Girl. So Blair Waldorf is actually one of the main characters and she's a super confident person. And I think that headband also gives her that little edge. And when she's wearing a headband, she feels a lot confident and powerful. So that is what I wanted to channel today with this uniform and that's why I threw on a little headband. So you know, say it's after school and you want to just ditch that blazer so you don't look like you're at school all the time, you can just throw on an oversized sweatshirt and that will give you that super super trendy look that is all over TikTok right now. So basically, it's an oversized sweatshirt look with a peak collar on the top and a tennis skirt. So you know, this is what I kind of did with the uniform after I ditched the blazer. In addition, I used this pearl hair tie which just adds that dainty look. At the same time, it's more of a messy ponytail. It's like you're done with school you just want to have fun and I also paired it with a matching white color small bag and I just love how this look like came together so I hope that these five looks gave you guys some inspiration of what to wear for the new school year so whatever your style is as long as you feel confident wearing it I'm sure you guys will look amazing so let us know in the comments down below what are your school dress codes like and you know maybe today we didn't follow it as strictly but maybe if you guys let us know we can do a part two and we will adhere to all your strict dress code rules. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Ladies First. Don't forget to tune in to our podcast on Spotify. The link is in the description down below. So click here to subscribe and click here to watch our latest video. Bye!